What? What happened? I didn't start it. Wow. Uh, oh, we're bringing this up. We're bringing this up. Every time, one of us always fucks up. So, John, John Spalding, you NBC, Cuyahoga County. Now, this is the second or third time. I knew it, but I knew it. The minute you were getting serious, I'm like, we don't. The camera's not. It, on. Was, it was good too, man. We, we had a good flow there going, man. But <laughs> that always happens. Every time we have a good flow going, you know, some piece of technology. Man, it's not on. All right, when you're trying to do independent media, it's really tough. We are backstage with Brandon Bell, June NBC, Cuyahoga <laughs> County, and the foot. <laughs> yep, yep. So for everybody Listen, that don't know, I we really just had a great a interview. Great interview that you will never see because the camera wasn't on. So how's it going, man? It's going great, man. It's going great. Uh, what are you guys doing here tonight? All right, so tonight is the uh, connected photo shoot for the connected web series that's going to be coming on G1 NBC. Uh, we will be dropping it this summer, so be everybody be looking out for that. And we're uh, shooting photos of the cast, main characters, and um, and you know it's really a lot of fun going on, a lot a lot of bodies, and and uh, it's, it's you know promote promotion going on for the show right now. It's a lot of fun. It's a, also a lot of work. What are a couple challenges that you had uh, since starting up? Uh, well, just. I mean, writing a series in itself is, you know, harder than what I thought it was when I first started. Um, you got character development. Um, you have to be consistent with your scripts. Uh, organization is key because you're not just shooting one movie, you're shooting multiple episodes and you got to make sure that, you know, when you're doing your casting, even though you you have to cast for episode eight before you even start filming and you just got to keep people in order and just keep up with everything. Like organization is probably the hardest part of uh, this entire process. But we have some great managers as part of the Connected. We've yeah. been doing some good work. Got an awesome team. Um, shout out Amanda. Shout out uh, 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 Dan, shout out John, shout out Richard, shout out Andre Patisse, East West Street, John Spalding, Sterling, Skip, uh, Amy McCorkle, uh, who's my uh, writing advisor, uh, Missy Goodman, uh, the whole Hill and Hands team, uh, Julie Fink, my agent. Uh, we just got a lot of people that's working on this project. Adam Clinton, he also got a good movie. That's this is like an Emmy acceptance list. Right, but it's a lot of people, man. It's, and, it, you know, for anything that's great, it does take a, you know, a good team effort to make something happen. And I'm just blessed to have a really awesome team. Candace Johnson, um, Eileen, Lauren, uh, Ali, um, all y'all. Like, I mean, I couldn't do any of this without. Benny. Benny. Oh, Benny. Rick. Like, Benny, Rick, uh, Roger. Benny's got the guns. B Benny's got the guns. He Benny's does got the graphic, guns. He does graphic arts for us. Pat Spelsey, um, he helps us out with the props and locations. Um, I, I know I'm forgetting people, but uh, Candace Johnson. Who, That's uh, okay. We got plenty of time writer. to thank him. It's just a lot of people. Uh, Sherry Tamitra, she, she's been helping out as well. Uh, it's, it's a lot of people that help out on this team, but I'm, and I couldn't get anything done without them. It's a big show. Uh, it's a big production that we're bringing out to people, something that really hasn't been done before in Cleveland, so it's, it takes a lot, you know, so. Yeah. yeah. So if uh, if you guys are watching our channel, if you see our link on our page, G1NBC Cuyahoga County, um, which is G1NBC.com backslash Cleveland, oh, hot, Cleveland OH, uh, you'll see a lot of streaming up there right now. And th Brandon's in a lot of that stuff because we did a lot of work last year. You might remember we had uh, Coffee for Closers. Coffee for Closers. We did a freestyle with Bobby Jones. Bobby Jones. Shout out Bobby Jones, man. You did an interview with uh, the detective oh, yeah, in Coffee the, uh, for Closers. Um, There's a great interview he, in there. He was, uh, the, um, he was the president of the, the Black uh, Shield. of the Black Shield for the Cleveland Police Department. That was a really great interview. Um, and I, and I, you know, it's, it's given me an opportunity doing uh, coffee for closers, doing G1 NBC Network Native Sustains to meet a lot of people, talk to a lot of people that, that's doing a lot of different things in Cleveland that, you know, either is known or I don't think gets enough shine and enough credit. So it's a lot of awesome people. A lot of awesome people. We're probably two of the more charismatic interviewers in Cleveland, too. So I think right. if you want to hit us up, right. if you, GUNNBC NetX will come to you. We will come to you. If you have a business, if you have a, a, a dream, an idea, um, you know, something that you're working on that you want to get shown out to the masses, you know, we will interview the hell out of you. Oh, my gosh. And, boy, will it be good, especially with made-up words. What's a make-up word that you use a lot in your interviews? Because I have one, if you don't. Um, I don't, but there's a made up word that I have that's really caught on fire. It's called dumbassity. Tell us a little bit about dumbassity. All right, dumbassity meaning, dumbassity means where there's something stupid or dumb that happens, whether it's an action, whether it's spoken, dumbassity. Like, for instance, the political system right now is filled with a lot of dumbassity. 
I see. You see how that works? Yep. Yeah, it just flows right into a lot of things. Like, man, you know, I'm, I'm at work and the copier was, you know, on some dumbassity. Um, you know, I saw Trump deliver a speech and it was just chock full of dumbassity, stuff like that, you know. When I read people's racist comments on Twitter, I feel that they are coming from a sense of dumbassity. Yeah, yeah. Like, I asked a white person, why did they use the word nigger, you know, on, you know, social media? And, you know, because I, I figured it was... Like, when was this? This was like a week ago. Uh -huh. Yeah, and, you know, I figured there was a lot of dumbassity behind that, you know. Uh, but, you know, it's, uh, there's, a, there's a... I would say nowadays in the world there is a high level of dumbassity. Uh, there's a lot of smart people, but, man, it's just... A high level of dumbassity out here. I think it's the news they read and watch. Watch is, you know, uh, it's just, uh, you know, it's a funny place that we live in today where, I mean, basically, you know, our political system is a reality show now, but let's not get into politics because I would love to. We're not going to do that. We will do that on some other programs. But when it comes down to it, don't one thing you can get political about is casting your vote for the Connected is like the best show that you'll ever see on the web. So, you know, with G1 NBC behind us, I'm thinking that's politics everybody can get behind. Hold up. As a businessman, I was Some people are just smooth, and it comes right off. Did you know that Cleveland was the... Uh, My wife is on the phone. Hey, babe. Hey, Kendra. Hey. hey you're, we're, we're live right now on an interview. How you doing? He always answers his phone when Kendra calls. It doesn't matter. What's up? He could be at the Emmys winning an award for the Connected, and he'll answer the phone from Kendra. Try to get the microphone a little closer. Oh, okay. Cool. All right, gotcha. Riveting. gotcha. I know you're upset, babe. So, look, let me, um, let me take care of this. I'm going to call you back in 10 minutes, then we can talk in detail. Okay, you you got the school on the other line. Wow. Oh, you got wow on the other line. Okay, so do you need me to do anything right now? All right, so I can take off of work. Cool, no problem. No problem. All right, love you. Yeah, so apparently I'm going to have to take off of work tomorrow because I have to wait for a while cable people to come to my house to fix repairs. That means you could drink tonight. I'm going to get pretty up. Yeah, that's going to happen. So It is not going to happen. No, nah, no, nah, it's not, man. I'm probably just going to go home and go to sleep after this. So, yeah. Cool. Well, hey, thank you uh, for letting us behind the scenes no uh, for your photo shoot and doing some interviews. Yes, sir. And uh, you break a leg, and we will see the connected this summer. Will do. Get connected, people. Thank you, John. Yep.